I'm Howard Hale. Thanks for joining us for the Cattleman's Corner. I'll be back with today's guest right after this. If you produce cattle, Cattleman'sCorner.com is a great place for you to advertise because there's new content up there every day. That means a lot of people visit every day. Cattleman'sCorner.com. Or if you're looking for good cattle to buy and some good cattle sales, go to Cattleman'sCorner.com. That's Cattleman'sCorner.com. A great resource for those of you in the cattle industry. Visit today. Gerald Dickinson ranches at Barnesville, Ohio. He says on his longhorn side of the things, he turns out about one bull to every 80 to 100 cows. How big are the pastures you turn them out in? Our breeding pastures are about 200 acres. We put a, a set of cows in a pasture like that, and, and uh, you know they're good for uh, oh, five weeks or something. And you move them on to the next one, and they're good for five weeks. And, Move them on to the next one, and then you're back to the first one again. Yeah, so that bull doesn't have to travel over a heck of a lot of country then. No. Our ranch is just a little under 5,000 acres, and it's divided into 71 pastures. And we've got just under 90 miles of fence. It's mostly five barb, sometimes electric. And um, every pasture has running spring water in it except one, and it's got a lake in it. So we don't even have a well on the ranch. How long can you run the cattle in, in your country? They graze year-round. If we get uh, enough snow that it just totally covers up the grass, we feed hay and, you know, whenever, if we have to. Barnesville, Ohio, Longhorn breeder Daryl Dickinson. Thanks for joining us for today's Cattleman's Corner. Always great to have you folks along with us on the program. And you'll find a lot more on the web by going to cattlemanscorner.com. May God bless. You come back and join us again, won't you? I'm Howard Hale.